MGT, what it do, man? It's your boy Moody Star, and I'm back again with another video. If you're new, you already know what to do, man. Become a subscriber, like the video, and join MGT. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and talk about my spiritual walk here in this matrix. So first of all, I got to say a special shout out to anybody that's holding on to your energy, going within, and being high vibrational. Here at MGT, dog, that's what we do. We work on ourselves every single day. So with that being said, bro, listen, man, I'm going to let you know that you are up next, okay? I know sometimes, like, and I actually just made a video about that, but, like, I want to start off with saying that again because... I really feel I really feel like this is a time where niggas really have to especially if you are in monk mode, bro. This is the this is the best time to really carve and put yourself together as far as like the man that you know you want to be. With that being said, when you practice semen retention, right? When you practice this this ancient technique, you are not like bro, you are doing this shit like yeah, for yourself, but I ain't going to cap with you, dog. Like this shit is complex, right? very very complex you are actually working on different parts of yourself different bodies different like you we have multi we are right, listen i'm going ahead of myself we are multi we are multi-dimensional beings meaning we have different parts of us parts of us that exist in different realms right we have multiple bodies you feel me believe it or not i'm not just talking about the bodies that you smash no i ain't talking about that but i'm just saying so with that being said bro understand overstand that once you master yourself, my guy, yo, women literally are, they, it's, it's all, I think it'll be more of a good, a great, amazing experience for women more than it is as actually it is for you just practicing the semen retention type of shit because you don't even know what you're doing, bro. Like you are actually going into different realms of reality when you master yourself and you master your energy, uh, the female I don't care if they're low vibrational, high vibrational, whatever the case may be. They're still a female. With that feminine energy, they're all about emotion. They're all about that type of energy, that unseen energy that you can't see. So essentially, bro, you you are literally going to have these women like all over you type shit. They will literally be all over you, bro. When you practice, when you practice like, all right, I ain't even going to lie. This is something that y'all should get into. And I haven't gotten into it in a while. But I would suggest things like yoga. Yoga, literally, it's like you are learning how to move different energies and parts of your bodies in different places. And it's like you're kind of clearing yourself up. Because whether you know it or not, bro, the average person doesn't fucking uh, stretch. You know what I'm saying? Unless you go into the gym or some shit, right? The average person doesn't fucking stretch or they like y'all like we would have different like parts of our body that. It's like it begin it begins to be clogged up in a sense. So, for example, like <clears throat> like if you was if you was to go to work or if you was to go out or if you're just doing whatever, bro. Like we live our life every single day, bro, in the matrix. You know what I'm saying? There's so much shit that we got to go through, right? And when you get older in in time and especially with age and shit, certain parts of your body begin to ache. But why is that? That's because there's not a steady flow of energy that's going through your body. You feel me? And it has to be your whole entire body type shit. Semen retention is literally like the gateway to literally getting to the point where you can where where you can master sex and it'll be it's like you wouldn't even have to put in a lot of effort to attract women. You feel me? Because you are already doing all the work with just with your body as far as like your breathing techniques with with stretching and like i said if y'all I, I don't know some guys is some niggas who who go to the gym they be like man i'll go to the gym i'll work out yeah i do my own stretches but i don't fuck with that yoga shit nigga believe it or not nigga yoga yoga is where it's at okay yoga is where it's at and i know i used to i used to actually fuck with yoga bro and every time when i went to a yoga class even though this shit is like very it seems like oh yeah it's just yoga whatever but anytime when i went to yoga class bro the shit was she was live as fuck. Like, I was getting... Je First of all, the room was nothing but women in there. You feel me? I was probably, like, the only dude in there. So, of course, like, shit. Why would I want to be in a group... Be in a room full of women and shit? And now they're trying to realign their chakras and shit, too. Like, nigga, hell. And back then, I used to I used to go to the one... Because um, they, they had different programs at, like, LA Fitness and shit. Where they got different yoga classes. I was like, man, fuck it. Let me try it. And at that time, believe it or not, I was actually going through, like, my like a, a different spiritual awakening. <clears throat> so 
And then I realized like the power I kind of had, like once I literally controlled my energy or once I knew how to make sure the energy within my body, within this third dimensional body <clears throat> was flowing nice. It was so eat like it became to the point where when I was dealing with women, it was all spiritual and I can't fuck, I can't fuck with a chick, even though, like I said, she's a female and shit like that. And, you know, all women whether they're low vibration or not, like they have that, they have that kind of, that feminine energy that most guys need to fucking exist, literally. But even if we not fucking them, just a female's presence. Excuse me, dog. I don't know why the hell. Let me get some water real quick. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry, y'all. Even when a female's presence is like around you type shit, there's a whole lot of shit going on. This literally, it, it does something to a guy. Like, you feel me? So, I found, I, I'm, I'm learning that, you know, some of the simple things in life, like I said, you know, stretching, uh, breathing techniques. Literally, if you want to master, like, really master the art of female attraction or just, you know, wanting to elevate in life, especially spiritually, bro, like, did see retention, and breathing techniques, yoga, all of that, bro. Like, literally, dog, it's going to get to a point where, like, man, everything will happen on, like, an esoteric level, if that makes sense. Like, there's something, there's certain experiences that I actually can't even put into words, dog, that where I, where I have female attraction, uh, and they would, they would link me on, on some spiritual shit. They, whether they was low vibration or not, and that's, I think that's what y'all need to uh, kind of look out for or kind of think about when you when you do want to take this uh, practice seriously you feel me so that's what i mean dog if you are already on this 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 kind of path of you know reawakening self-knowledge and and things of that nature because again the general population doesn't really know too much about this type of information you are up next my nigga like literally i know i just dropped a video about that hopefully it would have it would have posted by now but yeah you, that's why i said like it, it, there's experiences that I had, bro. Like, so one experience that I could talk about uh, without getting into too much detail was the fact that um, there was this chick that she she spoke Spanish too. So it, but it's to the point where it don't it don't even matter whether or not like y'all speak the same language. Once you know know how to speak the 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 language of energy, if that makes sense, I'm trying to make it make sense to y'all. It don't matter, bro. Like, it, you will always have that connection. So it was just one particular female. She spoke Spanish, and she was beautiful as hell. And this this happened some years ago. Yo, when I say the connection was so strong, but at the time, I don't think I was ready for it. It's like I accidentally kind of accessed this type of superpower where I can go to different places and I'll be thinking about something, and then it's always a female that, that either strangely strange this is strange as fuck but they'll come up to me and then they'll talk about something that that i'm thinking about you feel me or they will act accordingly to something that i'm thinking about and this particular female she spoke spanish but it's like we had our own language and it was so, it was such a beautiful such a beautiful relationship dog um and when i say relationship it wasn't like me and her was actually together but it was on some spiritual shit dog you feel me and there's a lot of things that i really can't explain but without saying without you know without saying too much or talking too too much about the situation i know me i don't know if it was like a i met her in my past life or what but she would she would just do certain things you know kind of come around when i least expect it you know um you know it it came to the point where you know what i'm saying we got close we got you know what i'm saying I would say intimate, but not what y'all call intimate, you know what I'm saying? But it was just something where it was magical, bro. It was fucking magical. And I think this, the semen retention technique and then learning about yoga, learning about your breathing skills, learning about the energy portals within inside your body, it, it will literally, it will literally up the experiences when you do uh, have any type of experience with any female, whether high vibrational or low vibrational. Now, obviously you want to aim for the high vibrational females, but even with the low vibrational females, 
you you like you'll still experience something but then now you don't want your life force energy to get drained or get stolen essentially you feel me because there's a lot of women that they don't deserve that shit you know what i'm saying and i'm learning every single day like hell i'm putting work i'm putting in work on my own self as far as my energy is concerned so if i'm going to get intimate with a female she has to have she has to put in that same type of work you feel me minimum that's just for me she has to put in that same type of work spiritually like I look, look, check this out, bro. I exist at, on a higher dimension right now. You feel me? Just because I have more life force energy, I'm going within. My my dreams are literally telling me different messages and different um things that I need to look out for. So since I live like on a higher dimension, literally like a, a part of me, like yeah, I'm in this dimension, but there's a part of me that's becoming conscious in in the fifth dimension, in the sixth dimension. Nigga, like, I I can't just give out my energy just to anybody. You get what I'm saying? So this is what I mean by, like, literally kind of evolving and really understanding, like, the power that you have with inside you. This whole time it was inside you. We just ain't been managing it. You feel me? Like, you got power inside you, but we really haven't been managing it the right way. You get what I'm saying? So just keep in mind that this this is a very complex thing. As far as um, <clears throat> as far as retaining your energy and as far as like just going about how you are going to carry yourself in the matrix and when you're dealing with women, just know it does get the higher you, the higher like you vibrate, the more magical, low key like your experiences will be. So you could be even talking to a female and you can make her, you can almost make her feel like y'all having sex just through a conversation and you won't even have to be saying nothing pr provocative you feel you, you get what i'm saying it's just like how you are coming off and what you're saying and how she's reacting remember women they're a lot more in tune with the spiritual realm and you know energy and emotions and shit like that so when you can get into that point where you can learn how to speak that language a little bit and they see that you're conscious and aware like they will literally do anything for you dog low-key you gonna have some women that literally they they will do anything for you. So just keep in mind, like, this shit is very powerful. You don't want to abuse the power, but it, it'll get to a point even, like, you can't really, it's, honestly, you really can't really abuse the power because energy don't lie. You feel me? Your intent is going to speak before you actually do something. You get what I'm saying? So without making this video too long, I'm going to end it for today, bro. Um, definitely like, share, comment down below. And let me know if you have some high vibrational experiences with women where you know you cultivated your energy and like they picked up on it and now it's it's just magic, nigga. Like straight up, man. I'm gonna definitely see you guys on the next video though. Make sure you like, share, comment down below. Peace.